Hello and welcome. In this video, we are going to learn one more feature of Oracle integration that is Visual Builder with the help of which we can build mobile and web applications. I am here in the Oracle documentation for uh, Visual Builder. So there is a preface given over here. You can go through this. I will directly go to getting started with Visual Builder. As you can see, this Visual Builder is a visual and declarative cloud environment for developing and hosting engaging mobile and web applications. With the help of Visual Builder, we can develop mobile as well as web applications. We will learn how to do this in detail in our uh, lecture series on Visual Builder. So there are a few features uh, mentioned over here. We can have a data management tool for managing the business objects. Uh, we will learn in detail what are business objects and how we can access the business object uh, resources with the help of REST based services. How we can import and export the data to the business object. How we can publish the tools. How we can uh, configure the role based security for our applications. How to collaborate uh, for development of application or by sharing our application code with our uh, teammates. The robust tools for uh, describing the request and responses to the Oracle SaaS REST services in integrated catalog. All this we will uh, look in detail. How to begin with first of all we have to have the subscription for this visual builder if you don't have a visual builder enabled you have to check out this link uh, how we can uh, enable this feature in oracle cloud infrastructure and there are a few bunch of details we can go through this coming to this anatomy of visual builder there are a few things mentioned over here like what are the building blocks and the basic components of visual builder for developing mobile application web application what are the service connections learn in detail what are the service connections how we can uh, consume the external web services with the help of service connections how to create a business object how to uh, make use of the processes within the application what are the building blocks variables is a very key thing while developing an application we are having the action chain uh, we will learn what are the action chains we have a uh, process flows U various uh, ui components which are based on this open source or actual jet we will learn what is the jet and the components available in that and we, how we can make use of this open source uh, jet components in our application with the help of visual builder how we can make use of the rest to enter the data in our web application or a mobile application we will learn in detail as we all know variables are the basic building blocks for managing the client state store the intermediate state on a client uh, between the visual builder user interface and the rest services page scope application scope flow scope we will learn uh, what are the scopes available for the variables at page level application level flow level and the action chain scope level this properties of the variables uh, in detail in our uh, hands-on series on this how we can make use of this types uh, leverage our application there are a few uh, implicit objects for the variables like the page variable application variable event variable listener variables etc and uh, also we can create our own uh, custom variables as well uh, life cycle uh, uh, variables and the events what are the events like on uh, entering into a page on exit of uh, a page all those uh, actions we will look in detail there are a few life cycles or the events before entering visual builder uh, entering the vb page or the flow before exit exit all those we can uh, make use and uh, we can have a chain of the variable setup the page navigations we will learn as i said uh, this uh, visual builder makes use of this open source uh, oracle javascript extension toolkit components if you want to learn in detail what are the offerings available in this jet we can go to this lane and uh, we can learn uh, in detail from this page there are a few properties child slots methods uh, how we can access the business objects using rest how we can make use of service connections and connect to the rest uh, web services we can learn we will learn how to do the data binding uh, mapping to and from the rest all those uh, we will learn in detail in our hands-on series so this was a, a brief explanation on getting started with visual builder to know the navigation for uh, visual builder you have to log in into your oracle integration cloud instance click on this hamburger menu on the left top corner from here we have to select the visual builder so once the visual builder designer page opens up we can create our applications i have logged into this visual builder designer page as you can see i don't have any applications created as of now there is an option if you have any applications already created then you will get the list of applications in a list manner over here so as i don't have i can go to this uh, new application and start creating on uh, creating a new application from scratch if not we can import application which is uh, developed from other environment uh, to over here here we can queue the uh, we will learn in detail how we can uh, build an application uh, from scratch in our uh, next video Please join us in that video.